to be or not to be? That is the question. Whether it is nobler in the, um, line. Line? Line? Line! Hey, uh, what happened? Reckon you were dreaming again. A nightmare it was. Ah, the golden herald of the morn does spread her golden wings and chase away the shadows of death. Yep, mighty purdy sunrise. I cannot look upon it, for its power doth humble me. Yep, reckon it's gonna be another fine day. Now, okay, so I think we're ready. I got the kitchen stocked and the cabins are clean and the beds are made. Yeah, that's the last of my list. Oh my gosh, are we crazy for doing this yet another year? Uh, define crazy. Uh, stupid? Blind? Wrong? Oh yeah, yeah, and a little bit crazy, yeah. Stop, it's not funny. <laughs> No, that was zero percent funny. Perk thine ears, old friend. A conversation is afoot. The time for eavesdropping is upon us. <sighs> okay. You're crazy organized. Breathe. Alas, the villain hath arrived. What's that no good diddly dang varmint doing here? Morning. 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 Jen? Matt? Hi. Councilman? <laughs> Councilman. Good to see you. Jen. Zach. Come on, my friends call me Zach. Oh. <laughs> Are we friends? I like to think so. I mean, I came here as a friend. Because I have a little bit of bad news. I mean, you know that your lease on this land is up in like two weeks. Yeah, yeah but I mean, I'm sorry you wasted the drive, Zach, but the, the city council is going to renew our lease. I mean, You're right, of course. It's just, here's the thing. The city could really use the money, and people will pay top dollar to have a condo like right here. You can't put condos here. It's a wildlife preserve. What are they saying? Be silent! With all the noise you're making, I can't hear them. The city could really, really use the money. So, uh, tell me, friend. Are you getting any sort of a kickback from your real estate buddies on this deal? Hey, this isn't about me. No. It should be about the kids. The city thinks this land could be put to better use. Better use, better use than, than teaching kids the arts, teaching them about conservation, about saving wildlife that's being just wiped away by people like you. Okay, easy. Whoa, hey guys, let's not shoot the messenger here, okay? This was just meant as a friendly heads up, right? That's all. As a friend, I didn't want this coming as a shock. Listen. You can't do this. Jen, it's not just up to me. The entire city council votes. But hey, you have two weeks to show them what you do here. That swine, that foul pig-headed lout. We talking about him? Of course him. Oh, I, I can see where that would be confusing. But he needs a dose of pork where the sun shineth not. He's gonna close this down. No, no, we just have to show the city council what this camp's all about. How? It would take something spectacular. Who are you calling? My sister. Really? Wow, no, I can't. I can't even understand why they would do that. Of course I'll do anything I can to help. Something special? I do think I have something special. Hey, Toby, you ready for another adventure? You ready to go to summer camp? Lana, did you hear that? We're going on a new adventure. Oh, no, we're not. Come on, let's go. Hey, Jack, what is summer camp? Arr, a magical two-week adventure it is. It's a place you'll learn discipline. No, it's not, Toby. Don't listen to him. Mom said it was the best time of her life. Good grief. Give me a break. Anna, you should go with him. There is no way I'm going. 
Looks like that decision has been made for you. You've got to be kidding me. Try to enjoy yourself, Lana. Will you two be quiet? Why do I have to go? Toby, this is all because of you. I love you, Toby. all these kids were. I do. I, I remember it like it was yesterday. What about this picture? <laughs> Look at me. Wow. Look at how long my hair was. <laughs> and that right there was the most beautiful girl that I ever laid eyes on. I fell in love with her that summer. <laughs> what happened to them? They got married. And they bought the camp where they met. And they lived happily all the rest of their days on that very camp. We will show the city council this camp is worth saving. It's worth so much more than just condos. Mm. Oh, it looks like the answer to our prayers is pulling up right now. Oh, you look great! Oh, oh my god! Oh, good to see you. <laughs> wow, thank you so much for doing this. Anytime. Oh, you remember Corbin, the groundskeeper? Hey, sure. Hey, Corbin, <laughs> how you doing? a few years, ain't it? Wow. <sighs> what you got in there? Sounds like a bull moose, don't it? Well, it's not a moose. Oh, I can't wait to see him. <gasps> oh, amazing. Oh, he's gotten big so fast. Yeah. Do you think he's gonna be okay around all the kids? That's why Chris is staying with you. Ah. Oh. Uh. You gotta be kidding. Ow. She's gonna take care of us? I'm okay. She just fell out of a park van. Ugh. Please, take me home. Come on, Lana. Just have fun. No. This is Chris. Hi, Chris. Hi. This is my brother, Matt, his wife, Jen. I'm Corbin. Hi, Corbin. Welcome. Welcome. Hello, Chris. <laughs> Chris will be taking care of Toby and make sure everything's fine. That's awesome. Yeah. Come on out, Toby. Come on, come on. Sit down, Toby. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be the best summer ever. It sure is. <laughs> oh my gosh. What do you say, Toby? You want to be the star of our show this year? What? Did, did she say star? She must be mistaken. Uh, here we go again. There is only one star, and I'm right here. That over there is no star. He sure is cute. Just be quiet so I can hear what she's saying to him. Oh, we got a spot set up for Toby right over there by Mojo. And we've got dinner set up inside. Yeah. So, uh, let's go. We don't have Come to worry on. about the kids tomorrow morning. Great. <laughs> hey, kid, wait for me. Don't walk away with her. Kid, I said wait up. Hi, I'm Toby. I'm gonna be the star of the show. I beg your pardon? Yeah, the star. That lady over there just said so. I assure you, sir, you misunderstood her. There is only one star, and I am he. 
<laughs> You're funny. Wanna look? I knew I smelled something foul. I should have known. Look, Racer, it's Lana. I see the years have not been good to you. That's not nice, Mojo. Hey, Lana, how you been? You looking good. Hey, Racer, I see the two of you have met the star of the show this year. A star, she says. You, sir, are no star. At best, you are a rank amateur. I am? That is so cool! I've only been here a few minutes, and I'm already a rank amateur! Amazing! <laughs> What's an amateur? I rest my case. Are you an amateur? I am a thespian. Whoa! I've never seen a thespian before. Actually, I've never seen anything like you before. Do all thespians smell like ham? I am not a ham. Uh-oh. I am a classically trained actor. I play all the greats. I once played the St. Crispin's Day Feast in a touring company of Henry V. I don't reckon he saw it. Perhaps you've heard my commercial. I am the radio voice of Oinkster from Fat Freddy's Lunch Meats. You know, bacon, pork. Bologna? No. Well, yes, but never mind that. Oh, that was you? I love that commercial. You are amazing. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Don't feed his ego, kid. He eats enough already. Oh, Lana. Are you still holding contempt towards me for stealing the limelight in last year's show? You did not steal the limelight. Are we gonna start that again? Racer's right. Let's just drop it. Hate to see Lana cry again. I was not crying. You always say that. Tell the kid you're lying. Oh, were you crying, Lana? I wasn't. Never mind him. Let's just focus on you, Toby. This year, you're the star, not him. Wow, a star. Whatever, Lana. Like I said, he's no star. An amateur at best, but not a star. All the world's a stage, and all the animals merely players. They have their exits and their entrances, and one pig in his time plays many parts. Hello? Is my mic on? Why is no one cheering? Hello? Hello? Hey, oh, oh. Was, was I dreaming out loud? Sounded more like a nightmare this time. Mm, why does this feel more like my nightmare? How do I end up in these situations? Hey, you guys, looks like the van is here. It's the summer camp van. I'm gonna go take a look. Not without me, Lana. Hey, guys. Hey. Good morning. Ready? We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Should be right good day. Yeah. Let's go. Here we go. Slow down, Mojo, before somebody sees you. That's the point of being a star. Oh, wow. Oh this is amazing. I know. Oh, I can't believe we're here. This is going to be the best summer ever. I know. <laughs> Establishing shots. <laughs> Skew your campground day. Ladies. <laughs> I'm Ashley, and this is Willow. Hi. Hi. I can hardly wait to start teaching them the craft of acting. Yeah, right. Hi, hi, hi. I'm Veronica. Oh, uh, what's happening? Is something happening? Who are you? I'm the director of this film. Aww. Are we doing a film? Wow, look at all this. Oh. What do you think? It sucks. Yeah. I can't believe Dad is forcing us to go here. Oh, yeah? How horrible to you with all the singing and dance. You must hate. Shut up, Robbie. <laughs> what is it, not Camp Rocky enough for you? Shut up. Hey there. Oh, hey. I'm Robbie. <laughs> it's super crazy. Hey, everyone. I'm back. You ready? We're on the back, Here we go. Hold on, man. Oh, 
Oh, I'll send it to you. <laughs> hey, I'm Timmy, the tech guy. Have an iPad, willing to travel. I'm Noah. <laughs> Good morning. Welcome to our pre-summer camp here at Showdown. <laughs> my name's Matt Keelan, and this lovely lady is my lovely wife, Jen. For the next two weeks, not only will you be swimming, playing volleyball, archery, and all the great camp stuff, but you're also going to be singing, dancing, and making your own music videos. <laughs> all right. It's not all, OK? At the end of our pre-camp, you're going to put up a live show for your friends and family and a couple members of the city council. And all the songs you'll be working on have the theme of conservation of land and animals. So let's introduce you to the star of this year's show, Toby! <laughs> Sorry. Hi. 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 This is amazing. Why is he getting a curtain call? Why does he already have fans? He hasn't learned the craft. Looks like you may be the understudy this time. What? Uh, preposterous. I am not anybody's second fiddle. I am the star in this camp. Yeah, you're something, all right. I'm Willow. I'm Noah. All right, all right, everybody, I want to introduce you to two of your camp counselors. That is Eddie yep. and Lynette. Hey. OK, girls, you're with me. Let's get to your cabin so you can settle in. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> this must be a joke, and I know you're in on it, Lana. I told you both there's only one star, and that star is me. Doesn't look like they know that. I've had it. I'm calling my agent. Agent, give me a break. There you go, ladies. Hi. Oh, this is so cute. Does anybody else want the bunk bed? Because if not, I'll take it. Unless somebody else wants it. I don't want to take it from anybody, but if someone doesn't want it, then I'll just want it. It's yours. <laughs> OK, thank you. Oh, thanks. I'll take this one. Great. That leaves the bunk closest to the window. Wait, what if one of the boys tries to look at it? Then we'll have you to take care of them. All right, that works with me. <laughs> this is our first time here. Have you guys been here before? No, first time. Me too. Uh, what about you? Me? Oh, no. My mom went here when she was little, and she said it changed her life. So she's making me go. It's supposed to help with my confidence. <laughs> well, I'm Willow, and this is Ashley. Hello. Yeah, we're this is going to be easier than we thought, bro. Oh, they won't know what hit him. He's right. We get to write our own song. Lame. Yeah, lame. Of course you did. What are you doing? Uh, trying to get a sense of this genre. Is this going to be a silly Bill Murray meatballs kind of camp or a creepy Friday the 13th camp? What do you think? I uh, don't know. Dude, you got to know what movie you're in. How else will you know if you should be scared or crack a joke or snap into action? Real life isn't a movie. Don't ever say that to me again. You guys are going to love it here. This is my third year. I'm Timmy. I'm your tech guy. So I'll be responsible for your sound, set, and lights. Cool. Thanks, cool. man. Thanks, Thanks, man. Cool. Thanks Timmy. This is the last of what you brought with you. Thanks, Corbin. Hey, yeah, uh, you think maybe we'd be a little more careful this year so we don't have a repeat of last year? You know what I mean? You got it! <laughs> okay, campers, first day auditions in the main hall. Ace, my most excellent compadre. Let's see what we can steal in here. Oh, yeah. This heist is going to make us most legendary danger, dude. Dude, what's that behind you? It doesn't matter. It's shiny and looks important. So we take it. 
We just get it. Yeah, let's get out of here. Oh man, I love stealing things. Oh, we are most corrupt. Okay. Auditions are just so we have a sense of what we're working with. We'll start with dancing, then we'll move on to singing. First, Eddie and I will show you the dance. Tommy, you ready? You bet. Ready. And five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Oh, Mojo, can you teach me to perform like that? No. Now it's your turn. Okay, everybody ready? And five, six, seven, eight. One push, two, three, four, five. Cross six, seven, eight. One post, two, three, four. Point, point, bounce, bounce, eight. Hold it, stop. What's your name? Derek. Derek, I want you to come down the front. What's your name? Robbie. Robbie, let's switch you out the back. Ready, and six, seven, eight. One push, two, three, four, five. Looks six, fun. Seven, <laughs> eight. It sure One does. Push, two, three, four, point, point, bounce, bounce, step. <laughs> Good work, guys. Are you ready for your first starring role? What did she say? Did she say starring role? This is insufferable. Is this one of those hidden camera shows? There must be a camera somewhere. Okay, joke's over. You can come out now. Looks like you've been replaced. They cannot do that to me. I, I have a resume. I have an agent. He's got stripes and he's cute. Who cares, Lana? I once played a giraffe in a touring company of Born Free, the musical. I am a star. Aren't stars supposed to be on the stage? I'll be in my dressing room. You just gotta angle it to the light and then look, you gotta press this button here and you're good. Oh, uh, uh, sorry, I just... Let's do some singing now. You were assigned to see. I can't forgive you. Listen for to her, Lana. Isn't she way. amazing? Are you hearing this? I would if someone could stay quiet long enough for me to hear her. Be afraid, I'll do the best I can. I've got one single purpose, and I think that you'll find there's a star so bright. <laughs> They sure are, kid. So they get on stage. <laughs> All right, next. Hi, is it okay if Willow and I sing our own song? We do everything together. Sure. sure. Okay. Hey, Timmy, can you hook these girls up? Thanks. No problem. <laughs> All right, you girls ready? Yes. Here we go. Sometimes you feel like people don't care. Sometimes you'll want just mope around. But why, why not? Always be proud. What good does it do to feel small? Only thing good is to stand tall. So we'll act like a girl and we'll play like a girl and we'll fight like a girl. No shame or denial. And Thank you guys so much. Dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Next. Uh, I didn't understand that one. It's performance art, kid. Nobody understands it. I get a little distracted. 
and only think of me. Forget all of the That was probably so amazing that angels will weep, but just a little out of butt. <laughs> Hi, I'm Veronica, and I'll be singing Defying Gravity. Well, unless you'd rather me sing something else. You've probably heard that one. I, I probably should have prepared something else. Uh, well, um, can I have a microphone, actually? I got it. Thank you. Oh. oh. If you just want to... Oh, you probably need you a blue this. cable. Probably not. You probably know what you're talking about. I should probably just butt out. Corbin, the orange and the green one? Please? <laughs> oh, oh, yep, it was definitely the blue cable. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everybody. I've heard so much talent today, my ears want to die of happiness. <laughs> I'm kidding. But you all are great. Here's how it's gonna work. Willow and Derek? You guys will be singing lead. Actually, Ashley and I usually... We're gonna get out of our comfort zone. It's not personal, it's just what's best for the show. And you guys are gonna be back up. <laughs> I get a little distracted and only think of me. Forget all of the action, something free. Well, don't stop. You can sing. What was that song? I've never heard it before. Nothing. It's it's not, it, it's just something I'm working on. Do you want to sit? <laughs> Wait, you wrote that? Oh, man, come on, you've got to show everybody. No, no, no I can't sing. <laughs> and yet, evidence to the contrary. I mean, can't sing in front of people. <laughs> well, then why did you come to a performing arts camp? My mom sent me. She thinks I have. <laughs> Potential? <laughs> well, I'm glad your mom sent you. <laughs> Come on, come on. <laughs> hey, has anyone seen Willow? I saw her by the waterfall, talking to Noah. Hey, can anybody sing a perfect D? I have a pitch pipe in my cabin. Awesome. Okay, I'll be right back. Thanks. Excuse me. Oh, hey there. Hi, um, where did you find that? Oh, this thing? I found it over lying in the dirt. Thought it was trash or something. No, I'm pretty sure it's mine. It has my initials on it. I'm Ashley Porter. Oh, there you go. Must have dropped it. Yeah, I must have. Yeah, must have. <gasps> did you hear that danger? She thinks he took it. Now that was most evil. Thanks. Yeah. Hey. Oh, I'm so excited. 
I like your necklace. Thanks. My mom gave it to me before she, um. Oh, geez. Sorry. Sorry. No, it's OK. It happened a long time ago. It's actually a family heirloom. Hmm. <laughs> you have a big family? Um, depends on your definition. My dad's gone a lot for work, but I have Ashley. Her family sort of adopted me. It's oh, kind of nice. She's like the nicest sister ever. <laughs> well, um. Lights out. I guess I gotta go. I'm gonna get you to sing. You can try. Yes. Yes, I can. <laughs> Good night. Bye. Let's go find something else to steal. Yeah, he'll be most pleased with that. I know that look. That is a boy meets girl look. You should save her this time. It's so much better than the boy loses girl time. Why does boy have to lose the girl? I don't know, that's just the way life works. No, it's the way movies work. I know, which is so much better than real life. In the movies, the good guys always win. The outcasts become heroes. Parents get back together. Life should totally be a movie, dude. Good girl. Good girl. This could be our last camp. The vultures are circling. Zach Carson, he wants this land, and so nothing can go wrong here. All they need is the smallest little thing to shut us down. So we, we need to put on a dynamite show. What do you say, Toby? You gonna be my hero? <laughs> Wait, what does he mean, hero? That did not sound good. Woe well, upon us, for we are doomed. What are you saying? Lana, what is Mojo talking about? I mean, it's the end of the fine light. Curtains closed, lights out. If we don't put on a show to end all shows, the camp is finished. Finished? Kaput? Calm down. He's just being overly dramatic. I am never over dramatic. I am always the exact amount of right dramatic. I am a professional. The camp is in trouble, yo. You heard him, Lana. The camp needs a hero. Somebody talking about me? Because my ears are burning. Ta-da! Cosmo! Hey, kid, great to see you again. Lana, you old dog, how have you been? Did you miss me? Oh, we sure did, Cosmo. We missed you like crazy. Oh, kid, you're making me all sappy inside. What are you doing here, Cosmo? Hero stuff. Hey, Racer, Mojo. Ooh, from the smell in here, I'll take it. The whole bathing thing never really caught on with you. Rude. Wait, you two know each other? Everyone, Everyone knows, knows Cosmo. Cosmo. Word on the dirt paths is there's trouble brewing around these parts. So I came to lend a paw or two. See what I did there, paw or two? You're in trouble? More than you know, kid. What are you babbling about, Cosmo? What are you talking about? Why is it every time you show up, something bad is about to happen? Shh, let him talk. Word in the forest is there's some new guys in town. Who? They might be ghosts or, or, or lunatics escaped from the pound after being told they have rabies or, or maybe even Bigfoot. But one thing's for sure, they're heading this way if they're not already here. Help me get out of here. Lana Cosmo, do something. We need to find those bad guys and save the camp. Stay away from that gate, Toby. 
Oh, let me out of here. I'll help you, kid. Cosmo, can you open it? Kid, I've broken out of much worse places than this. But move back and let a professional show you how it's done. Don't you undo that latch. What's that? I couldn't hear you over the sound of the latch opening. Cosmo, don't do it. Too late, got it. Toby, stay in your pen. I promised your mother I'd watch out for you. Would you look at that? It opened. You promised me and your mom you would be a good cub on this trip. Come on, let's go save the camp. Good grief. Here we go again. I'm going with you. Hold on there, fellas. I want to help, too. <clears throat> oh, danger, dude. We have perpetrated a most heinous crime again. The boss is going to love us. Right you are, my friend. Hey. Throw that thing in the fire before someone sees us. Ah, <sighs> the smell of burning plastic smells like victory to me. Soon the whole forest will know our names. Oh, is victory supposed to stink like that, dude? Sure does smell bad. Let's get out of here. No, Toby. Whoa! Were you too slow down? Look what I. Whoa. Don't you do it, mister. He isn't doing what I think he's doing, is he? Water! This is amazing! It's just like our last adventure! Get out of there this instant, Toby. We've got to get back to the pen right now. I got a bad feeling about all of this. Oh, please, just a few minutes, Lana. <laughs> Please. Hello, guys. Mission, camp closing. Toby, get out of there. Cosmo is right. We gotta get back. <laughs> okay. Ugh, kids these days. Follow me. Wrong way, Toby. That was way too close, Danger Dude. I agree, Ace, my friend. I can smell that tiger from where we were hiding. If we get caught, the bus will be most displeased with us. Well, let's get out of here before they come back. Guys, slow down. Lana, let's go toward the cabins and see if they're over there. Toby, stop! Wait for me! Oh, no. There you are. Ugh, busted. Let's get you back before someone sees you. I told you this was going to happen. You too. Come on. I told you to go the other way! Whatever you do, don't tell Mojo about this. We don't need one of his I told you. Lana! Toby! Did you hear me? I'm never gonna live this down. Oh, that was another close call, Danger Dude. Way too close. Let's go. You're sure they were here? Yes. I left them here last night. What are you guys looking for? Flash drives with the music on them are missing. She back once you can do it. No, I was going to have Timmy do it today so he could load them onto the iPads. Somebody stole them? No, we don't know that. It's not the first thing that was stolen. What are you talking about? Yeah, what are you saying? Looks like we've got a thief. What are you talking about? My pitch pipe. It went missing and I caught Corbin with it. The groundskeeper? I knew it. What did I say? Hollywood doesn't let me down. It's always a creepy groundskeeper. No, maybe you just misplaced it. That's what he said, but I know I put it back in my luggage. He has the keys to the cabin. He had to have taken it. Right, Willow? Ashley, I don't know. I didn't see it. You got your pitch pipe back, right? Well, yeah, but Corbin... And Corbin, we've known for over a decade. He's an employee and a friend. Trust us. It's not him. But... But nothing. It sounds hot. Hey, guys, hey, 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 Look, can we just use different music? That might work. I have some stuff I was working on for the talent show. Yeah, me too. OK, so we'll just divide up in two teams. Boys versus girls. Yes, boys against girls. But <laughs> oh, what, we... why? Are, are you afraid that we're going to smoke you? <laughs> Come on. Come on. Boys, 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 Boys against the girls. <laughs> now, everyone, take a seat. Hey, Eddie, will you help me with this? There's something wrong in the camp, Mojo. I haven't felt this much tension since I played a dinner theater serving pig's feet. What? What do you think that contraption is for? Okay, remember, 
We only have one really cool magic trick, so we'll work out with Timmy that each group has enough time to rehearse with it. This will be the centerpiece of each of your shows. All right. I'm going to show you how it's done. <laughs> now pay close attention. This is Mojo. I told you I was the star, Lana. She's probably introducing me as the lead right now. You may want to take notes. I'm not watching. Wait, wait, what is she doing? Why is she putting me in a cage? Lana, do you have something to do with this? This is most unbefitting for an actor of my stature. I will get even with you, Lana, if it's the last thing I do. I am so ashamed right now. What is going on out there? I'm getting dizzy. You can stop now. Some, something is happening to me. I'm starting to feel funny. And now... <laughs> Our star, Toby. Oh, this is amazing. Luana, did you see that? So we'll divide into groups and go into rehearsal. Ash, um, why did you make it boys against girls? Why didn't you back me up when I said that thing about Corbin? You were supposed to have my back. But I didn't actually see him take it. Did you? Well, no. So you see? No, I don't. How can you not believe me? Ash, that's not what I'm saying. No, I get it. You need proof. I'll get you proof. Hello, ladies. Rehearsals. Hey, can someone let me out? Lana! All right, you ready? Yeah. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One. Okay, girls, <laughs> was I really on that first? A little bit. Um, the beats go more like this. Toby, stop fooling around. Tisk tisk, amateurs. Attention, campers. Let's take an hour break so we can enjoy some summertime fun. Watch that clock on work is almost done. Counting down from five, four, three, two, one. Let's run. It's a perfect day. Go outside and play. So here we go. Six, seven, eight. One, two, three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, eight, one. All right, guys. Yeah. Oh, we still need to work on the yeah. song. Anybody have any ideas? Oh, at first I was thinking anthem. Get the crowd invested like the Rocky theme. But uh, now I'm thinking more novelty. Comedy number. OK, yeah. Wait, didn't someone say you wrote a song? What? Um, really? Yeah, but it's not very good. Why don't you sing it for us now? Come on. Uh, yeah, let's hear it. Good. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's gotta be 
It's gotta be a great song, like, like perfect. Is it a perfect song? Yeah. I'm not sure if it's perfect. Oh, oh yeah. come on. You can do it, man. <laughs> Why don't you stand up here and sing it for everybody? Go ahead. We're all watching. Louder. Can't hear you. Come on. Noah. 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 What's wrong with this? Hey, don't worry, guys. I may have an idea. This way. Oh, man. What the? My guitar. And what? somebody stole my strings. He's my friend, just like we planned. That guy thinks someone else stole his strings. Danger, my most excellent brother. We are villains of the highest order. Those kids have no idea who's behind all of this. That's Bummer. Wait, easy, easy. We don't oh, know that man. someone stole them. Yes, I do. My strings are right here this morning. I'm telling you guys, somebody stole them. Ooh, plot twist. I know who did it. It was the girls. What? No. Hey, think about it, man. They didn't want us to win. It had to be the girls. Come on. That's right. The boss is going to be most proud of us for all the trouble we have caused. Let's go. Three and four, five and six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. OK, <laughs> ladies. It's time with music. Where is my iPad? Come on, guys. This isn't funny. We can't rehearse without it. Who took my iPad? I don't, I don't know. know. Hey, Timmy, did you take my iPad? No, I, I have my own. Oh, I bet it was the boys. Do you think it was the boys? I think it might have been the boys. Do you, do you think it was the boys? I bet you're right. Those guys have been out to the stories from the start. And I bet you he's in on it. Who, me? Real funny. Who destroyed my guitar? What? We didn't destroy your guitar. Well, somebody did. Why would we touch your stupid guitar? Because you're afraid we're going to crush you. Oh, as if? You guys stole Annette's iPad. We know you took it. Just give us back our stuff right now. Give us the strings back. We didn't take anything. We've been right here all the time. But your spy, I'm sure he has it. Who, me? Guys, we did not take your stuff. You guys have been doing this the whole time. Are you kidding me? Why would you do this? What is going on? They oh, took oh, our oh, stuff! Oh, Lynette, what's going on? Some things have been misplaced. Hmm. Not misplaced. Stolen. I still think Corbin did it. OK, it's not Corbin. I'm sure it was just a prank. Ha ha and ho ho, just some good natured fun, right? So if somebody did take it... For fun. For fun. Just hand it back. This does not sound good. Okay, maybe that's too embarrassing. Okay, uh, so here's the deal. We'll leave a box outside our door tonight. I expect the items to all be there in the morning. Everybody understand? Great. All right, you guys go get ready for lunch. We'll pick up rehearsal later. Oh boy, this is bad. I better go back and tell the others what's going on. Hey, Lana's back! Bad news. They believe the kids have been stealing from each other. Doubt thou the stars are fire. Doubt that the sun doth move. Doubt truth to be a liar. Ah, whatever. What are you going on about now? You need to stop worrying about your so-called career and start trying to figure out who's behind this. We gotta do something before more stuff goes missing. Toby's right. We need to figure this out fast. Danger! Look over there! Even they have no idea who's behind this most evil plan. If it wasn't one of the kids, who could it be? Oh, look over there! Uh, who's that? And what's that they're holding? <gasps> We're in danger, Danger Dude! We've been spotted! As I live and breathe, it's the Duke Brothers. 
Do you know them? No, I know of them. They're the most wanted animals in the forest. Whoa, did you hear that, Danger Dude? We are the most wanted animals in the forest. The boss will love to hear that. Dude, we are most excellent thieves. Oh, let me at them. We need to catch them before they get away. Get me out of here. Tiger alert! Abort, dude! Abort! They're taking off! Let's get them! Guys, get me out of here! Wanna help me? I'm too old for this. Come on, Toby. Let's get them. Hasbro's hero time! Right behind you, kid! You know I don't do my own stunts, right? Guys, wait for me! I wanna help! They're getting on us! They're over here! We got them now! Aw, oh, dude, this will not end most triumphantly! Just stick with the plan and keep moving! There's no way those fools can catch us! Over there, I can see them! I see them, too! Keep up, Cosmo! I'm moving! I'm moving! They're right behind us, Danger Dude! I'm so calling my agent about this. I am an actor, not a stuntman. Lana, catch them before they get away! Keep running, Mojo! We almost got them! <laughs> Short legs here! Danger Dude, drop the goods here so we can live to steal another day. Righteous plan, Ace, my friend. They're gone. They were right here a second ago. Doesn't make sense. We're right behind them. I blame Mojo, because he's not here to defend himself. I heard that. You take that back. It's not Mojo's fault. Thanks, kid. Lana, anything? Nothing. It's as if they vanished into thin air. They're just gone. What about you, Mojo? Do you smell? I most certainly do not. It's that raccoon. Wait, what? You take that back right now! Will you two stop bickering? We need to come up with a plan. Did you hear that, Ace, my most corrupt brother? They think they can catch us. They are such fools. No plan they ever come up with will ever stop us. We are most corrupt. Let's go show the boss. Hey. Hey. How's rehearsal going? Pretty good. Until the iPad went missing. Oh. Well, ours is going much better. I don't know. Things will get better. Hmm. Sorry. My bad. <laughs> I was just going to put some cinnamon on my... mashed potatoes. You too? I didn't know anybody else put cinnamon on their mashers. Only the cool people. <laughs> Are you done? <laughs> Come on. I'm going to get you proof. What is he doing here? Is he your new BFF? Come on, Ash. He's just here to help. We don't need his help. Can I help? Thanks. Will you guys hurry up? It's right over here. Are you sure about this? Come on, guys. You know me. I saw this thing on YouTube where this guy caught a thief by using a beehive and, well, look above you. This is a bad idea. Your worst one yet. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Trust you? You must be kidding. All I have to do is <clears throat> tie this rope around this hive. Come down here this instant before those bees attack us. Come on, I got this. Mojo's right, Cosmo. This is your worst idea ever. Come on, did I let you down on a last adventure? This is going to work. What is he blabbering about? We need to get out of here before someone sees us. Almost got it. <sighs> Done. Those two fools won't know what hit him. Let's get back to the pen and tell Racer what we did. Do you even know what you're doing? I looked it up on YouTube. Okay, so we're gonna 
spread it out. Just flat. I'm gonna tie this around it. Ash, what do you want me to do? Can you just hold it down so it doesn't go anywhere? Sure. Thank you. Can you guys help me pull it? Yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll look it up Ready? Perfect. Good job. Keep going. A little bit more. Use our muscles. Almost. One, two, three. Oh. <laughs> uh, Cosmo? Yeah, kid? Do you think this will work? I don't know, kid. It sure looked good on YouTube. We'll see in the morning. Good night, Toby. Okay, Lana. Good night, everybody. check the trap. Wait. I'll come with you. Tell me who's gonna be in there. I don't know, Ash. Hey, what time is it even? I'm not sure. Oh, let's see what we got. Um, well, no Corbin, huh? That doesn't mean that I'm wrong. That's not what I'm saying. Probably get going. Yeah. Come on, guys. Did you look up exactly how to do it? I did. I don't know why it's Wake up! <gasps> Lana, Mojo, Cosmo! Let's go! Come on, come on! We gotta see if the trap worked! Get up! Get up! So then I won my first acting award. Huh! I swear the raccoon did it! Uh, will someone shut that ham up? Is it morning already? Keep it down! Some of us are trying to sleep here! Oh, sorry! I didn't mean to wake you! Cosmo, let's go check and see if we caught those thieves! Come on, Racer, you won't want to miss this! Stop pushing me! I'm a going! This better have worked, Cosmo! Trust me, you smelly ham! Wait up! Hey, wait for me, guys! Guys! Wait up, I'm stuck again, guys! Guys, I need a little help here! Oh, we didn't catch him! I don't understand this! It worked so well on YouTube! Sorry, guys. I knew we should not have trusted such an amateur. Now what do we do? Lana, now what? Let's get back before someone sees you're missing. I could have slept in today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, so, eight, one. So, do you think it really is Corbin? Four, five, six, Ashley sure believes it. Guys. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get your nose. Nice. Oh. You're so cute. Ashley? Hmm. Huh. <laughs> you need a stronger safety line. It's a 16 gauge. You need 13. Look, I know what I'm doing. Trust me. Mm. Like you know anyway. See? <gasps> <gasps> oh, well, look at he. 
here. They've been looking for you. <laughs> for that totally lame beehive trick. That raccoon's lame attempt to catch us was only foiled by that foolish groundskeeper. What's that? It's those strings we took. Let's steal them again. Yeah, let's go show the boss. Ready? And five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, guys. Don't worry about it. We'll work on it after lunch. Hey, man, what is with you? What? Quit embarrassing me. You? Yeah. Do you know how stupid you look out there? Don't let this whole actor thing go to your head, OK? Hey, Derek, got a sec? What? What are you doing? I'm doing the best I can. No, you're not. You're better than this. You're really good. Why do you let your brother treat you like hey, that? Hey, if you have a problem, take it up with my brother, OK? Don't talk to me. Your brother is not the talented one. You are. Scott, he's the captain of the football and the basketball team. He's got a full ride scholarship. He's my dad's pride and joy, OK? So take it up with him. Don't talk to me, man. Nobody. You don't know what nobody is, man. Teachers ever forget your name. Your dad ever forget your birthday. Would you really rather be invisible than Look stupid, you're not nobody. I just can't believe this is the somebody you choose to be. guys have it, please give it back now. Please, it means so much to me. This isn't funny anymore. Just give it back. I don't know what you're talking about, but I didn't take anything. Yes, you did, Timmy. Oh, just give it back. Just it. Can you hear what they're saying, Danger? Not a word. Let's get closer. All right, guys, come on, come on, come on. Everybody listen up. Stuff is missing, and it's no longer a prank. We need whoever took the stuff to come forward. Then I have no choice. We we have to shut down the rest of camp. That's what? No, what? We will call your parents and have them drop up as soon as possible, OK? We can't in good conscience keep the camp open. I'm sorry, believe me, but it's not safe. I'm so sorry. I didn't no, mean to. It's not you, sweetie. It's not your fault. We have a thief. What are you doing? Me? They're going to shut down the camp. Good. Since when do you care about what happens to a bunch of theater geeks? They're not geeks. They've been working their butts off for this. It's not fair. Fair. 
You do remember why we came here, right? Better than this. Yeah? Well, if it makes you feel better, bro, I didn't touch any of that stuff. So, it's over? They're gonna close down the camp? Nah. Maybe this is just the apparent defeat. You know, where it looks like all is lost before the hero saves the day. This isn't a movie. I know. I hate real life. I'm sorry about your necklace. Who could do such a thing? When we get home, why don't you come over? We can watch movies, pick out on ice cream. Tomorrow night? Sounds amazing, but no one I sort of made plans. Plans? What is wrong with you? Ever since we came here, you've been acting weird. We came to this camp together. We are supposed to be doing things together. This is supposed to be our thing. It still is. Why doesn't it feel that way? I don't know. That's what I'm talking about. You always knew. I never had to say anything, and you always knew what I felt, and now you don't. We're still BFFs, Ash. Are we? <sighs> if she doesn't want to be your BFF, I'll be your BFF. What? Well, you want to be the only friend Willow has. You must be such a great friend that no other friend will need another friend. Ashley, you must be like the greatest friend ever. Thus all the world's a stage, and we are but fortune's fools just playing parts. There comes a time in every show when you realize it's over, lights off, curtains closed. In other words, we've been canceled. I'm afraid Mojo is right. Anna, what are you saying? Toby, things are different here. We did the best we could. Lana's right, kid. Sometimes life is just an empty trash bin. A dumpster with no leftovers. No, you can't believe that, Cosmo. If we fail, the camp closes. I hate to agree with the raccoon, but it's over. Don't actors always say, the show must go on? That's only in the movies, and this is no movie. Guys, we can't just give up. Ah, uh, what are you doing? He's right. Let's do this. <sighs> Let's go find those rats. Thanks, Lana, for not giving up on the camp. What a waste of time. Well, here we go again. Oh, look, everybody, the trap is sprung! We caught them! They're not here. How'd they get away this time? Cosmo, come take a look! Impossible! Those bees would have stopped a bear in its tracks. It sure did stop that groundskeeper. Did we capture the heathens? No, they managed to escape again. I said it once, I said it twice, and I'm saying it now. Why in the world are we trusting Cosmo? He could not find water in an ocean, even if he fell in it. Which ocean? Do I need to say more? Will you be quiet? They have to be close. What fools? Lana, what are we gonna do now? We'll find them. They can't be far. Let's go get them! Right behind you, kid. You fools are trusting him again? Let's look in some of these cabins. They could be hiding in one of them. I hear something in this one. Let's check it out. Shh. Cosmo, do you think they're here? Let's go. If they're not in there, Toby, we need to fire that raccoon. <laughs> I smell honey. I'll check over here. <laughs> well, Cosmo, on a positive note, we know who set off the trap. And I think he's allergic to bees. Did you find them? Is it the Duke brothers? Are they here? There's something over here. Let me get this sheet. Ah, the raccoon found us, Ace. Run! Oh, they're getting away again. Let's get them. Lala, Lala, calm down. Oh, 
Corman, are you okay? Corman! How'd that happen to you? Are you okay? Oh my God. That looks terrible. Look at that, look at that works. Corman's the thief. I knew it. The guitar strings. What? Hey, Willow. Hey, hey Willow, wasn't this your necklace? Yes. Thank you so much. Oh, I can't believe this. You, you stole all this? It's here. It's all here. I knew it. Bad guy gets nailed. Predictable, but satisfying. Real life rocks. We trusted you. You left me no choice. You're fired. I can't believe you. I can't Give it up, Duke Brothers! We got you now! Don't let them get away this time! Oh no, Ace, my dearest compadre, they have us! Nice work, guys. We got them. Okay, okay, you got us. We surrender. No, we don't. Alas, you fiendish fools. Your time in the spotlight has drawn to a close. Come down here, you swines! What? You said that on purpose. Oh, sorry. Just come down and apologize. Apologize for what? Doing what we do best? Wreaking havoc and causing chaos? What, pray tell, are you fools doing up there? Let's do it. What the? We are true villains. Super villains. Well, I must say, I never saw that plot twist coming. Let's get out of here. Well, you gotta give him credit for ingenuity. Don't just stand there, go get him. It's time to make our getaway. Man, those dukes are most corrupt. Come on, Lana, let's get them. I'm too old for this. That escape was most epic. Right, you are, Ace, my friend. Now that we have all the missing stuff, does that still mean you're gonna shut down the camp? We are staying open. Kidding me? This guy have to do. Well, if Corbin leaves, there's no reason not to finish the show, right? I don't see why not. Did you hear that? Let's go. Drive. Well, what if we added some drums? Here. Love it. Again from the top. <laughs> Ready? Seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four. What the? What happened? Oh, we must have blown a fuse. I'll go check. to ruin it for the girls? They totally think he ruined the show! What's all the commotion going on? Let's check it out. Guys, look at this. It wasn't his fault. Look at this. It's been chewed through. Not you guys again. Haven't you learned anything? It's them! I am really starting to dislike those ferrets. Move! Go get them! We have no stage, and with Willow's iPad destroyed, we have no music. We have no lights. No lights. This is the third act rallying point. What? 
This is the part where we come together. Their stuff, our stuff. We build a new stage. Can you do that? <laughs> we could use your song. We could pull this off. Guys, it's a great song. What song? You wrote a song? What? No, no. Do you have it on your phone? No. Wait, I thought you played it I, from- I have it. Yeah, oh. I filmed it the day your tryout. <laughs> I took the liberty of adding some, uh, you know, music myself, but it actually sounds really good. I cannot believe those two ferrets got away again. I'm out of ideas how to catch them. Guys, we need to do something to prove it wasn't Corbin who took all their stuff. And how do you propose we do that? Mojo's right. All our plans have only made things worse. So that's it. Are we gonna just let them win? Lana, that poor man needs our help. Toby, we've tried everything. What more can we do? It's over. Hey, if we add a little guitar there and some drums here, this could be a really killer song. <laughs> Derek, we're gonna do this together. No, we will not. What? This place sucks. What are they talking about over there? He keeps pointing at Toby. They hire a thief, they let their sets be destroyed and almost kill someone, not to mention wild animals. Who, me? What's he talking about? We quit. Derek! All right. They just lost our duet. Ashley and I have always sung together. If you'd be willing, no. He should do it. No, no, you're way better than I am. Willow thinks you're really good. And so do I. <laughs> Me too. What she said. Uh, well, I'm not. Oh. Don't insult my friend. Yeah. She has great taste. <laughs> Let's rock. Yes! Yeah. Right. Let's go. <laughs> no, Dad, don't worry. It's it's all going. It's all going according to plan. Yes, I did. No, no, no. There's there's no way they're going on with the show now. I told you. Yeah. No, Dad. It's all. No, I. Hey, what are you doing? What did you do? Somebody could have been hurt. They were gonna go on with the show. Somebody had to stop. And them. your brilliant idea was to kill someone. What's wrong with you? <laughs> this is wrong. Enough, okay? Derek, who cares about a stupid show and a bunch of nobodies? You better decide whose side you're on. Oh no, things just got a whole lot worse. right here clear as day throw them over here lead the way to start it off we gotta make a little slice cut it once but go and measure twice grab some nails and squeeze to make the connection and as easy as that we're on our way to perfection you can't sit on the sidelines wait for it to happen come on don't you really Crystal clear like a film scene. A job so big that we oughta get busy. Give me a hammer. Hey, what's the fuss? Timmy, put that hammer down. Don't wanna hurt yourself or us. Always knew that I actually could make something like this from some slabs of wood. With help from my friends, it's all making sense. You can call me Tom Sawyer with my picket fence. Stop! It's hammer time. Then it's all right here on the line. They're counting on us. We can't fail it. Whoa! Sixteen mil sock? Oh, you mean eighteen mil? Don't 
do you know? You're right. No. Congratulations on your re-election as mayor. Oh, well, thank you. I look forward to another productive couple of years. Oh, and a dynamic show tonight as well. Well, we like it. I'm sure I will. Come on, I'll take it to your seat. I'm so nervous. You better not make a fool of us. It's showtime, and you should be nervous. Will you be quiet? That's not helping. Toby, you were going to be great. Do you really believe that, Lana? I really do, kid. I'm very proud of you. So go out there and put on a great show. What do you think, Cosmo? You're a natural, kid. Go out there and show Mojo how it's done. Thanks, guys. You're the best friend an animal can have. Stop all this blabbering before I start crying and ruin all my makeup. That's makeup? Rude. I'll be in my dressing room. This is going to be a great show. We have the best seats in the house. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Showdown Talent Camp, where talent and nature, humans and animals, come together as one. One, two, three, four. It's true, if everybody can only think like that. We lose all of our bodies like a friendly jungle cat. The only thing to do, get up and make a move. So we'll speak for those who can't speak. We will all through the night. We'll be the strength for those who feel weak. Though we're young, they'll feel our bite when we are here. Take your places. There's our cue. I'm so nervous. You're gonna be great, kid. I get a little protective when my friends are feeling dull. So then I have to defend them if they're human or animal. We live on this planet together. It's time we start to share. And live like two birds of a feather to show we really care. The only thing to do Get up and make a move. So we'll speak for those who can't speak. We will all through the night. We'll be the strength for those who feel weak. Though we're young, they'll feel our light. When we are hand in hand and paw in paw, all right. My favorite plot, where Mojo disappears. Mine too. Ah, my adoring fans! So we'll see for those who can't speak. We will all through the night. We'll be the strength for those who feel weak. Though we're young, they'll feel our light. When we are hand in hand and paw in paw. Hand in hand and paw in paw. Hand in hand and paw in paw. All right. All right. Hand in paw, all right.
Oh my gosh, they worked so hard. Oh, on well, that song. it showed. They they were adorable. <laughs> I don't know how you do it with they that really many kids. Yeah, they did a great job. I'm telling you, oh. we, we enjoy it. So. Well, congratulations on another great show. Thank you. Mommy! Oh, <laughs> sweetheart. Oh, you were amazing. Thank you. I love this place, Mom. It like totally changed my life. Oh. You had better do something about this, and I mean right now. I could barely speak in front of a mirror, let alone a crowd of people. <laughs> That's when my mom and dad sent me here and changed my life. <laughs> we vote on Monday, but it's just a formality. Congratulations, we're renewing your lease. Oh, wait, okay, wait, I'm sorry, Mrs. Mayor. Um, not quite so fast, Mrs. Mayor. Um, I know they did a great show, and you guys did. It was a great show. <laughs> <laughs> we just have one small problem. Um, I know for a fact that there have been a rash of robberies here, and the thief is a long-standing employee of theirs. Is this true? Yes, no. yes, no, yes. yes. No, I know, I know you guys have the best of intentions. But can we really put the welfare of our children in the hands of people who would hire a felon? And what about the animals? Is this really a safe environment for an animal as, as large and as dangerous as a tiger? I mean, come on, what if he had bitten somebody? I don't think this is a safe place for children or the animals, but really, our children? Great show, kid. Toby, you were amazing. You mean we were amazing. You both did a great job, but was it good enough to save the camp? We never did catch those ferrets. Toby, we did everything possible. It's that mean boy. Take your places and let's catch a real rat. I'm not gonna hurt you. He's coming! Cosmo, the lights! I'm on it! Lock the cage. Yeah, got it. Make sure it's locked, good and tight. He's not going anywhere. I told you this would work. You should be ashamed of yourself for what you've done. Corp got fired because of you. You finally had a good plan. What do we do with him now? I got a plan. What was that? Sounded like a tiger. Toby? Come on. Toby? How did you get out of your cage again? Roby? Oh, come you on. Are so busted, mister. Let me throw a little light on the subject. Uh, What's uh, going on here? Uh, Bobby, why are you in the cage? I, 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 I. I Ace, uh, we gotta uh, get that phone. There's there enough proof on there to sink us. You brought your pet ferrets? Yeah, I. I... Don't say anything. Let him do all the talking. Dad, Ace and Danger have stolen everything we taught him to take. I'm so proud of him. Wait, you're the thief. No, 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 no. Robbie, what have you done? How could you do this? Dad, that's enough. We are gonna have a conversation about this. But Dad... That is enough, Derek, okay? No, it's not okay. He did everything you asked. He sabotaged, he stole. He did this all for you. You will not treat him this way. I can explain. And it is a really, really good explanation. Good. Put it in a letter right above your resignation. Come on, honey. No, 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 no. It, it's a funny story, really. Corbin. Why are you doing this? Because that's what brothers do. We're family, and family sticks up for each other. That's what makes them a family. Corbin, Corbin, don't go! 
You don't think a tiger on his hood is a bit intimidating? Try lying down. Uh, what are you mm. doing? Mm. Get down. Corbin. Corbin, we... Oh, thank goodness you're still here. We're so sorry. We made a huge mistake. Please, take the keys. Turn the truck around and come back. Oh, we love you, Corbin. <laughs> You hear that, Toby? You helped save the camp. And Corbin. Wow, we did it, Lana. We're heroes. And once we took down the Duke brothers and this corrupt politician, I performed in the show where Mojo disappeared and I reappeared in the same cage and Mojo was like, I'm the star, but everyone knew I was the star, but we were all kind of stars and heroes at the same time. <laughs> Toby, that's quite a story. It's just like the kids said. He was a real hero, saved the show. And who is this Cosmo? Did someone say my name? Cosmo! What are you doing here? I heard from a friend who told me a friend of his heard the Duke brothers were seen following that Willow girl back to school. Please, tell me you're joking, Cosmo. I don't know how, but what I do know is it's time for our next adventure. We're going on another adventure? Cool!